Yeah, do you want me to be? Okay, okay, pal. Now we're gonna sharpen this end so it goes into the coil better. All right, let's see her. Drill that guy too. This is the tug test to see if it's gonna stay. Looks good, I'm giving it a pretty good tug. Wow, you are. I think we just need to put some electrical tape on it and test it out. So do you mate. And we're gonna see if we get a spark across that gap. Woo, yeah, it's good spark. Solid. Yay, it worked. Yay. <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. Yay! I didn't kill the engine right there, it stopped itself. Oh, did it? Yeah. It's the RPM's really low. I don't know if that's because, like, the electrical signal is, like, weak. Huh. So, if you hold throttle, it goes to full RPM, but it's, uh, it's kind of weak at idle. I got some of that. Okay. Are you Yeah, go do it again. What? Do it again. His neighbors love him. <laughs> so we increased, that's hot. So we increased the idle a little bit by turning that screw just a little bit and uh, to see if we can keep the idle around 2000. started but it seems to die at idle because I think the screw makes a, a weaker spark so we tried to increase it increase the idle via the screw down here and um, <clears throat> that didn't seem to help it uh, might just be better to get a new coil or solder it all right time for a motorcycle ride okay mm -hmm. I can't tell if it's recording right now or not it is so you have a limited amount of space on the camera for recording it seems like if you're oh, that's not focused at all there it is Pops, am I right?
Did you make a dookie in the sod field? Oh my gosh, you did a little pup. Hey, oh my goodness, hi. Oh, you're really cute. You just dookied in the sod field. That was on scrum. Oh my face. gosh. That's some brown dookie. Can you smile? You're so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. So I was able to get a flight out of it, two flights, and um, we tried it again and it doesn't seem to want to start. So I'm just going to wait until I get that new ignition coil and call it quits for now. But it's kind of cool to know that in a pinch you can literally just put a wood screw in either end of the ignition coil and make it work. Um, you could probably do that with some other type of wire as well on heat shrink or electrical tape or something if you really need to get back somewhere. but. It doesn't run very well. The RPMs are all over the place unless you're at a full climb. But hey, it was a learning process and we'll wait for that new coil to come in. So thanks for watching. What are you doing? Playing with it.